Hey everyone, my name's Pupsker, and today I'm going over where to get both Necros and Necros Prime. Necros Prime has recently been unvaulted from the Prime Vault, so hey, perfect time to make this video. So Necros Prime himself is farmed in kind of an annoying area. He is farmed in the Derelict Assassination, and that is Lephantis, but... Oh god, sorry. Uh, you might, you know, just know it as the Derelict Assassinate. His... Uh, Base blueprint is 100,000 credits in the market, where his Neuroptics chassis and system all drop from the assassination at a 33.3% drop rate. So that's all well and good, but you need to get the Derelict Assassinate key in order to actually do the mission. You have to, you know, create it in your foundry, just buy it off the market, it's 1,500, and it's a reusable blueprint, because it needs to be. It has a reusable, or sorry, a unique component, and that is the Derelict Assassinate, or sorry, the Lephantis Nav Coordinates. Yeah, I know I messed that up. And that can be picked up in really any one of these Derelict areas. So, build the keys for all of these if you haven't picked up any of the keys. Buy them in the market, build them, and get farming. It really shouldn't be that bad. Necros should generally take a little bit of time, and the boss that you actually have to kill to get Necros isn't that bad, just bring a high damage weapon so that you can headshot pretty easily on. Because you have to hit a smallish, not really that small though, target in the air. That is the enemy's, you know, vulnerable spot. As for Necros Prime, that is a different story. Necros Prime is not that bad to farm, not at all, let me tell you. So far, at least. Uh, since Necros Prime has just released, currently there's only one unvaulted relic, but I'll go over them all as I always do. The blueprints can be picked up in Lith T3, Lith N3, Meso N3, and Axie N3, with Lith T3 being uncommon and the only one unvaulted. Uh, that's a pretty easy farm, I would say. All of this is farmed in the void, so it's all very simple. This one is tier 1 and some tier 2. A drop rotations in tier 1, exterminate capture, and defense is not bad if you get to, eh, max round 2 I'd say. So really, it's a simple farm in the void. Now, going over where to get the Neuroptics, it's all pretty simple I would say, so don't worry guys. Is Meso 04, Meso F1, and Axie N5 with Meso 04 being uncommon and the only one unvaulted. That one can also be picked up in the void, as they all do. Uh, drop chance on this one's a lot lower, and that kind of sucks, can't deny that. But hey, it is what it is. Just do what you gotta do, right? Farm up the sabotage, mobile defense, and maybe survival if you want. But yeah, it's always up to you, right? You can do whatever you want. Next, for Necros Prime, we have the chassis. And that can be picked up in Axie S6, Lith N1, Lith V4, Meso K1, Meso S3, Neo Z1, Axie G1, and Axie N4. Yeah, with Meso, or sorry, with Axie S6 being the only one unvaulted, and that one is a common. Now, I don't actually have the numbers for Axie S6, I guess it's still a little too new, but that's fine. We have always the search, so we can just see where to farm it, right? So you can go to Atten, Bellinus, Marduk, Mithra, Mott, all in the void, and as always, Cetus Bounty or Val's Bounty. So those are like always there. So it's not really hard to farm this one either. Just go just go for seed drops on the ones you can, I guess, just cuz. Um, so again, it's an Axie Relic, but it's in the void, so the drop chance isn't, hopefully isn't the worst. I want to say that uh, the Lith one is probably the best, with the Mesa one being one of the worst, but hey. Maybe uh, Axie ones are even worse. But hey, I don't farm in the void too much, because hey, who guns in the void? So farm that boy up and do what you can. Lastly, for Necros Prime, we have the systems. That will drop in Neo and 11, Lith N2, Meso N5, Neo N3, and Neo N7. With Neo N11 being a rare and the only one unvaulted right now. Neo N11 is actually not too bad, has 11% drop rates from the 
Void T4 survival and interception. Uh, defense T3s aren't too bad either, but hey, you're better off sticking to the Void T4s. So that's pretty good. You have multiple Void T4s that'll give you um, both the Neo and 11s and Axes. So just go to Mithra or Mott, honestly, and pop those boys out. Have a good time because. Looks like a decent drop chance. So Necro's Prime, not bad at all to farm. I might actually farm him up myself since I only have base Necros right now. Guys, if you uh, liked that video at all and if it helped you at all, please remember to subscribe, comment, like, favorite, all the fun stuff that every YouTuber who has ever existed tells you to do. I play Warframe, I do guides, and maybe I'll stream once in a while. Really, who knows? I'm not a great streamer. But I like to play Warframe and I mainly like to make guides on it. So. Subscribe if they like them. Share my stuff, and I will see you next time. Peace.